quick shop tour. Here it is. Oh, obviously there's boxes because there's always boxes. Um, so this side of the shop tends to be homewares, candles, you know, that kind of lark. Um, but depending on how much stock I have and what space I need, I do put other things on. So, for example, notebooks, pens, a stationary selection. Um, I try to make it flow colour-wise. Yeah. Colour-wise, I do tend to try and make it flow. I may not do that always, but it's the end. It's the idea. Um, so yeah, so the yellow of the stationery leads into like the yellow and the gold. So these are the new sliders. Um, so this, and then the card section is at the back of the shop because cards are probably my bread and butter. So I tend to try and make people have to walk past all the things that they don't need to get to the thing that they might need and created a new central display, which again, so I used to have um, the card spinner here where this shelving unit is and then some shorter like boxes stock, stacked up and it actually made the shop look smaller than it does now with the taller display space. Um, I use my spiral staircase for displaying because um, folk can't go upstairs so it stops me going upstairs and also gives me more display space. Uh, a little glass cabinet with my fancy stuff in, um, more of central and then I have my children's department over here. I want to keep my children's things. That. Um, once for a day I didn't used to have this in front of the counter but covid times it just makes people sort of stand slightly further back from the counter if that makes sense and then finally we've got like the jewelry and girly kind of section here 